Discount Chadtronic here. Woof. <coughs> 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 Guys, as you can see from last video, I cannot cook very well. It's burnt. But, I managed to find a video that can teach me, me, how to cook better. I know, an insane idea, right? It is called the Country Cooking Restaurant Training Video. Let's get into this. I want to learn how to cook. I'm company president David Preston and I'd like to welcome you to the country cooking family. Oh, glad to be here mate. One question though, can I keep my maiden name? <laughs> We're glad to have you with us. As a new member of our family, we want you to think of the restaurant as a second home. A second home? Or a prison? For our guests, we want it to feel almost like home. Just without the work of cooking and cleaning. Think about how you would act if you were having guests over to your own home. You'd be sure everything was clean for their visit. You'd greet them at the door and tell them you're glad to see them. You'd offer them a drink. You'd take care that the food you served was... served right away. When they left, you'd invite them to come back again soon. Well, it's the same here at Country Cooking, and nothing is more important than you. Me? You. Me? Nothing is more important than you. David Preston. Wanna earn big tips? Not trying to be rude or anything. I know, I know that she meant to say tips, but let's just say this. It does not sound like she said tips. Here's the secret. Genuine, friendly service. Take good care of our guests, and they'll take good care of you. Let's start with your appearance. For some reason, you humans keep getting uglier and uglier every generation. Cut off your lips. What the heck was that? She's clean. Her clothes are not wrinkled and fit properly. And most important, there's a real smile on her face. No, no, that's a fake smile. That's a fake smile. I should know. I put fake smiles on all the time. One that shows in her eyes. Here are some accepted outfits under the country cooking dress code. Your manager or trainer will give you a copy of the dress code and answer any questions. Good service and good tips. Begin the moment a guest walks in our door. It's especially important to help our first-time guests to feel comfortable. Ask guests, are you familiar with how things work here? Try to avoid phrasing that could offend regular customers, such as, is this your first time with us? Well, I say, good sir, that is quite offensive. You know this is my thrice time, once removed, five score, sixty-third time here. <laughs> okay, that was really stupid. For first-time guests, include a red flag placement with their menus. What the, what the heck is a red flag placement? That does not sound very safe. But there are some specific things you need to know to help your guests have a great dining experience. We call this the server sequence. Ah yes, the server sequence. 3.14159654. Get it? It's pie. Because <laughs> they're serving pie. Ah, ah, ah. I'm a riot. Greet guests within 30 seconds of their arrival, taking silverware with you. Smile, say hello, and make a personal connection with your guests. Ask if you can start them off with some fresh brewed tea or a Pepsi. Then, ask if you may take their order. When taking orders, speak first to the guest on your left. Try suggestive selling by mentioning the feature item of the week. When the guest orders, be sure to find out how they would like their entrees cooked, what side order they would like, and any special sauces you can bring them. The only sauce I'd like is... Szechuan. 
Come take a what make eye contact. Speak smile clearly. Smiley, polite, be polite, and action. You making a connection orders. <laughs> Sorry guys, it just really felt like splicing all of those clips together. We know you're going to be a great addition to our family. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to ask your manager or trainer. You know, thank you so much, David Preston. I think finally, now, I'm ready to cook. Hey, 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 what, what, what you cooking? Oh, dude, I'm cooking a berry. Come check this out. Blueberry? What is this? Mul mulberry, that's it, mulberry. Dude, you want to try some after? Once it's finished? It's insane. See, guys, this is, this is how you cook. Okay, it's gonna take a while. Gonna have a meaty taste on it, cause you know we use this to cook up the taco meat. Yeah. Here we go, dude. Get all that onion stuff on it. Oh, dude, that's good berry. That is one slick berry. What? Gotta flip it. Oh, look at that. The blood of it. I reckon we're done. Where'd it go? Oh, come on! <coughs> oh, it smells. Ah, oh, ah, oh. it's disgusting. <laughs> I mean, it's cooking. Oh. It's hot. Don't eat it. We'll eat it. Food poisoning. Oh. Salmonella. Oh, oh dude. Should be serious, that's foul. Dude, 